What's up guys, we're going to go ahead and review WebRoot Secure Anywhere Antivirus 2024. Now, if you guys want to try a, a free trial like I have, I will post a link on the description of the video. When you go to the link, it'll look like this and you get to pick three different ones. The one we're reviewing today is the Secure Anywhere Antivirus right here. Just click on the start free trial and it'll open up the download, install it, and then this is what it looks like here. Right off the bat, it detected a threat here, but it wasn't really a threat. It's just a uh, quote unquote hack tool that I have that it doesn't like. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's going to scan your computer as soon as you install it, which I like that. I like that. It's OK. All right. Now, this is a paid version. It would cost $30 a year. All right. For one device, one year. Supposedly, they're giving you a 25 percent discount, but that's always there. You know, it's sales tactics <laughs> all right this is what it looks like here um i'm not seeing much i am not seeing much um oh here we are okay you got it when you go to utilities here click on a little sprocket now we could see a lot more stuff let's see what else they have well they got the they got the scan you click on scan my computer it'll start to scan it now what sucks about this is while it's scanning we really can't do anything else with the program check this out we can't really do nothing else with the program. <laughs> we can't look at anything. That sucks. I know I don't have any viruses in the computer in my computer. Um, the only thing it picked up was that hacking tool. But so we can look at the rest of the program. We're gonna go ahead and cancel it. But it looks like it goes pretty fast. It goes pretty fast. Um, let's look at the rest of the stuff here. Let's go to utilities. Because if you're gonna pay for something, you guys you better get more utilities than just antivirus. You know what I mean? Other than password manager here. Well, actually, let's start from the top. Let's start from the top. Why not? It's got a real-time shield. Real-time shield, which is good. So it's got active protection. If a virus tries to get into your computer, it'll pick it up while it's happening. It's got a web shield, which will protect you on the Internet. It's got a firewall to protect you on the Internet as well. Uh, it's got privacy shield, privacy phishing shield as well if you go to a website let's say uh, you get a message on Facebook saying hey check this out you click on it then it takes you again to Facebook to log in you're like what the hell wasn't I already logged in that's a fake website that's called phishing you put your email I mean you put your username and password on there they got your password it wasn't the real Facebook website so it'll protect you it'll tell you hey you're not on the real website so that's good that protects people a lot it's got a password manager um manage your website passwords uh you can even use them on your mobile device pcs and Macs. so it's cross com compatible across a lot of uh, the devices that's good so you're getting some good stuff for your money here 30 dollars a month a year that's not bad that's actually pretty cheap compared to the other antivirus programs utilities all right let's see what we got here now i gotta say this program is not very user friendly uh, somebody that's new to computers is not going to be, you know, he's going to click on password manager right here. You know, click on more or utilities, right? Utilities, YouTube, where the heck are they? Where are they? And you got to click on the little sprocket here. A lot of people might not uh, know how to use, so this is not very user friendly. This is probably more for advanced users, that's why. All right, anti malware tools. So here you can reset your desktop wallpaper. You So you check it, then you click run. All right. In case of virus, viruses do that all the time. Your desktop wallpaper will change to, hey, your computer is hijacked. Pay us a certain amount of money. Click this, hit run. It'll throw that off. Reset the screensaver. Set system policies to default. Reboot into safe mode. Oh, that is a beautiful, beautiful tool. Oh, that, that's beautiful right there, guys. All right. That's good. That is the tool that I always look for. Reboot into safe mode. Beautiful. If the virus has taken over your computer, you can't do crap on normal mode. If you go into safe mode, you'll be able to do more, be able to change the more settings. So reboot into safe mode is a beautiful thing. Beautiful. I love that. Love it. Okay. Okay. This is good. Perform an immediate system reboot. Boom. You can do that too. All right. Manual threat removal. You can remove files using Secure Anywhere and automatically remove associated registry entries. Oh my goodness. That is badass. That is badass. If you are into the IT industry and you need a tool that will do this for you, oh man, I, I'm starting to like WebRoot, Secure Anywhere. This right tool right here, yes, yes. You can tell that WebRoot is actually catering to techs out there. These are tech tools that you need 
If you're a computer repair technician, this is beautiful. Because sometimes you try to delete certain things and the registry entries are still there. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, um, this is uh, computer lingo. <laughs> Tech computer lingo. But anyway, the registry, registry entries will be deleted as well. That is beautiful. You can just select it from here. Boom. Heck yeah. Removal script. If a web researcher has instructed you to execute a removal script, select the provided script. Oh, that's beautiful. You can also do scripts. So, I got to say, WebRoot Secure Anywhere is for technicians, man. Buy it. I would buy it, man. This would make your life so much easier because you literally got to use different uh, different uh, techniques to do everything. You got it all in one program here. That's beautiful. This is awesome. These utilities are the real technician utilities that people need. Reports. You could look at reports. You need to do the log. Sometimes when you do a job for somebody, they're going to be like, show me the logs. Show me what you did. Here you are. Boom. Right. They want to know you actually did do something. There's technicians out there that will tell people they have a virus and they really don't have one and charge them for a virus removal. Yeah, that's bad. So for people, for the common people, if you're not a technician, all right, this works beautiful too, guys. These tools here will give you an edge. You probably won't even need to hire a technician thanks to these tools. All right. Uh, threat log, execution history. Oh. You see what people have been executing, what programs you've been using, protection statistics, research assistance. Oh, they even have a research assistant team. Submit a file with a web root. That's beautiful. System control. Control active processes. So here you can see your processes that you're running. And here you can close them, stop, monitor, block. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, this, this tool is a beauty, guys. It is a beauty. And you have safe start sandbox. So if you have a program you downloaded and you don't know if it's legit, like a quote unquote hack tool, <laughs> open up the sandbox, run it in there. And if it's a virus, it won't, it won't destroy your own computer. It'll destroy the sandbox environment, not your computer. This is awesome, guys. I'm starting to love WebRoot here. All right. The utilities on this is awesome. At first, I thought it didn't have much, but it does. $30 a year, guys, is worth it. It is extremely worth it. My account here... Um, yeah, you could you could change it. You got 14 days subscription here. Uh, here you can go ahead and change it if you buy it. You put your code in there, and that's about it. There's also a supporting community. You got customer support from Webroot, which is good. All right, this is good. I like Webroot. Webroot Secure Anywhere Antivirus is going to get a five out of five for antivirus. Of course, we have other ones we're going to test as well. Internet security and complete security we'll look at those but for antivirus $30 a year it is worth it guys I dig it I dig it now these utilities there you every technician has them for free you can get them even a regular user you can get these you can use these for free but if you don't know how for example reboot into safe mode you know how hard that is in Windows the new Windows uh, 11 or 12 I think or in Windows 12 right it is insanely hard. Or Windows 11, right? I'm getting ahead of myself here. We're in Windows 11. I'm saying 12. <laughs> Windows 11, reboot into safe mode in Windows 10 is a freaking nightmare. You have to, like, press a certain key. And, yeah, no, no, that doesn't. You have it all right here, guys. Webroot Secure Anywhere Antivirus is going to get it. Five out of five star because of those beautiful utilities, guys. This antivirus program, I recommend it. It's all here. All the utilities are here, right? I can't stop looking at it, man. I'm actually going to use this for my own personal self for 14 days. I might not pay it, but <laughs> you know what I mean. If you guys want to pay for it, $30 a year is not bad. And you got all the tools you need here, guys. If you guys can afford it and you want to keep your computer safe, this is perfect, guys. I think Wearboot's taking the cake right now these days. All right, five out of five. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. One last thing before we leave, though. Uh, let's look at PC Magazine, see what they had to say about it. I should have done this in the beginning. Sorry, guys. If you guys are still here, uh, here's an extra uh, bit of information for you. The pros, it's got a fast scan, tiny size program, light on system resources, remediate ransomware damage. That's good. Ransomware is big these days. And those tools that I showed you actually help you against the ransomware. Advanced features. Uh, the problem looks like it does have some cons, though. All right, we're talk, we're, we've been talking good about it, but it has some bads. No longer offers remote monitoring. 
And perfect protection against hard modified ransomware. Ooh, so they're really badass ransomware. You're going to get hit. Limited lab. Well, we're going to have to go four out of five. Sorry, guys. I forgot to look at the cons here. Advanced features required uncommon expertise. Just like I was saying, guys, the features on here are for like technicians, not for the common person. <laughs> no volume discount. Firewall settings can't be conf can be confusing. Huh. Okay. Uh, I changed my mind. Four out of five stars, because of uh, if you get a really bad ransomware, it's gonna take you out. I was hoping it would protect against that. But anyway, these are everything that comes with it. On demand malware scan, on access on access malware scan, behavior based detection, website rating, malicious URL blocking, phishing protection, vulnerability scan, and firewall. And I'm sorry I'm showing you guys these in the last part of the video. All of my videos are unedited. I just go through unscripted, go through with it, just like if I was talking to you personally. So that's the way we do videos here, guys. Uh, I prefer it that way. We're going to take a look. One last thing before we end the video. Let's look at the lab results. And I should have brought this up earlier. But uh, where's Webroot? Where's Webroot? Webroot? Here it is. Number of labs they did one. And there's no score. Not enough information for a score. Hmm. That could be bad. But if you notice, there's a lot of programs here with uh, uh, not applicable ratings here. For example, I mean, they're like Microsoft has nine. McAfee has 9.7. We will be looking at those. It sucks that they don't have. But anyway, there's more There's more of them that we have down here. Where's the other ones? I know they have other ones. Here we go. All right. Here we go. Here it is. Protection score is 9.4. That is high. I mean, the highest we see here is 9.8. 9.8 from G-Data and Zone Alarm. Um, that is pretty pretty high. Oh, look. Malware Bytes Premium has 10. Huh. I'm going to look into that one. We, we reread the free one. But anyway, let's go back to Webroot. 9.4, guys. Detection is 95% of what they tested it with. And it blocked 93% of malicious URLs. That's not bad. That's not bad. There is other antivirus programs here that did better. We even have 100 percenters. Like Sophos. That sucker got 100%. We're going to have to take a look at Sophos. 9.9? .9? Wow. All right. But yeah, Webroot is 9.4. So like I said, we're going to go down to 9. I mean, we're, we're going to go down to 4 out of 5 stars, guys. This video is already long enough. There's the test from PC Magazine, so you can see it for yourself. Webroot antivirus. Uh, it's got a lot of good utilities. The detection is up there. It's in the 9s. Not bad. I, I'd say it's worth it. There is better ones out there. But for the utilities part of it, I got to give it a good rating. So 4 out of 5 stars, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you soon in the next video.